हेलो दिस इज चिराग एंड वेलकम टू वेन्यू डॉट इवेंट्स वेन्यू डॉट इवेंट्स एक ऐसी वेबसाइट है जो वेडिंग और कॉन्फ्रेंसेस के लिए आपको परफेक्ट वेन्यू फिल्टर करके देती है पैन एंड फिल्टर्स के थ्रू आप देख सकते हैं हमारे वेन्यूज के हॉल साइड सीटिंग स्टाइल सीटिंग कैपेसिटी विद इन थर्टी सेकेंड्स विदाउट एनी ह्यूमन इंट्रैक्शन सो बने रही हमारे साथ इस वीडियो को लाइक कर लीजिए हमारे चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कर लीजिए और बेल आइकन दबा दीजिए ताकि आप हमारी वीडियोज कभी ना मिस कर सके um castle mandava is a very well known uh, in the trade uh, everybody knows about the property this is a heritage fort which is converted into a luxurious hotel um it is uh, basically located in a shikavati region it is uh, in junjunu uh this property it was built in 17th century and it has a luxurious room along with the rooms we have a huge lawn pool area the property caters to inbound tourists it is a great attraction nowadays in domestic car market wedding is one of the segment which has picked up of lately very high for us uh people are very keen to do a destination wedding especially uh, royal weddings and this is one of the best place for a royal weddings yes uh, mandawa is a uh, very popular um, is one of the known place in shikavati it is basically a place uh, from where the desert starts so it is a uh, basically semi arid uh, region uh if you see the desert begins from mandawa then you go further to bikane you further go to jaisalmer so here you will have a experience of uh, desert sand as well as you have experience some kind of plantation also here the place is basically um uh, surrounded by lot of havelis these are uh, villages which were being built in uh, almost 17 to 18th century back and it belongs to all the rich traders uh, who used to basically do trading um, especially you might be aware of the silk route belt so this belt it, this used to fall in a silk uh, route belt and here you still see the ancient art culture which was now, now which has slowly vanished from rajasthan also but once you come to mandawa you will see lot of people still uh, still associated with those kind of art architect so a uh, lot of avenues which are like open art gallery you will see lot of floral work being done on there so basically these are fresco paintings hand painted paintings yeah this uh, in fact um, post covid the things have been good in terms of wedding segments and especially amis what i have seen is like weddings have become one of the very important segments for all the hotels now Uh, reason being um, after covid like people started exploring every destination for even small small events like even for a uh, small birthday parties social gatherings and weddings is one of the segment which has boomed uh, extensively especially a destination weddings and these royal weddings have become very popular and places like rajasthan is rich in culture so people prefer to select uh, any destination in rajasthan and um mandawa has picked up very well in a year we are doing almost 20 to 25 weddings and these weddings are not only indian weddings in fact uh, we are doing uh, international weddings also we have a uh, recently we did one of the german weddings there we had a charter which fl- uh, flew from um, germany and these people wanted to do a, that royal wedding and we have done a lot in terms of promoting our tourism so i feel the wedding segment has become one of the popular segment for us uh, we are giving them a royal uh, experience royal feel and they are especially in these uh, uh, hotels like heritage hotels you don't need to spend much because everything is so beautified yes. in there every place every nook and corner is like done you don't have to spend much on decor lighting yeah. a small lighting will also create so much of effect especially uh, these royal weddings um, there you know the size of hotels are huge you can have both the bride and bridegroom family in one particular property and you have different venues to offer you don't have to change you know in same venue you don't have to make the um you have experience of different venue generally what happens in corporate hotel is the same venue and they have to change the place and decor of that venue but here you get different venues you sometimes you can have a different lawns different kind of pagoda so we are getting lot of residential conferences because uh, the place is such here there you can do lot of team work um, uh, team uh, building exercises and uh, these days corporates they would like they have generally prefer to give their staff different kind of experiences and especially in mandawa you can have experience of dunes you can have experience of you know 
those uh, royal safaris you can go for and a uh, lot of team building exercises see uh, castle mandawa is one of the old property and it's a very luxurious property we have 85 rooms and the best is each room the minimum size of the room is like 500 we have even the rooms which are more than uh, 1200 square feet and uh, these are as big as you know a banquet hall and um, every room is different and every room has a story to depict. So we have those uh, hand painted uh, paintings being done in the room. Some rooms have a theme of Ramayan, some rooms have a theme of those ancient um, gallantry wars, you know. So people like to remain in their rooms and they, you know, they yes. uh, carry some kind of experience and memories with them. Apart from our room, our USPs, our washrooms are also. So our washrooms are as big as our rooms. So yes. some of our rooms are 300 square feet also. And um, apart from the rooms uh, which are one of our USP, uh, we have a very beautiful pool and there are um, uh, poolside weddings which are happening because the pools, uh, this is one of the biggest pool in that very region. And um, we have different lawns. We have a special uh, area, Sajan Gar area, which we promote among weddings. So Sajan Bagh basically. So that is a place where we are generally people prefer that area because um, there are different venues in the property and uh, when our guests they are staying with us, we are taking them for heritage walks. Apart from heritage walks, we are making them aware of those ancient cultures and artwork. Uh, we have these um, uh, people who are engaged in shoemaking. We have those pottery guys who are engaged, uh, how it has been instilled. People are engaged in their uh, basic occupation like bangle making.